Hi everyone, Father Eric from St. John the Evangelist here, standing outside of our parish activity center. Our church renovation has now begun, and so everything that we're doing, our masses, our confessions, our baptisms, all of those things are now happening here at our parish activity center. But today, I wanna to take you on a quick tour of our confessionals so that you know where they're located at now, how to get in, kind of how to navigate all of that. So whenever it is that you come for the Sacrament of Reconciliation, you know exactly what to do. So let's head inside and take a quick tour together. Okay, so we're inside the gallery of our parish activity center. Church, our mass, happens inside the center itself. But in the gallery area is where we have three brand new confessionals set up. So one of the confessionals is mine, which is right over here on this side. And what you'll notice is all of the confessionals have been marked and hopefully pretty well indicated. So confessional, who's confessional? This is Father Eric Arnold's confessional. The other two that we have are up this way. Father Jeremy's is the other freestanding new white reconciliation room. And Father Maurice's is right next door in one of our former offices. So three confessional rooms. Now, you're probably wondering, when we show up, where do we line up? Well, what we've done is we've set up signs to indicate where each of the lines goes. So for Father Maurice, his confession line begins here, and it's just gonna move down toward the door you'll know when he's available when his confessional door is opened up. And so that's true on all three of ours. Father Jeremy's sign over here is where his line begins. And again, you'll know when he's available, when his light inside is on, and you're free to go in when his door is open. And then the same for mine. My confessional line begins right here, and it moves this way. So we're keeping people away from the confessionals enough so that there's privacy. But let's take a look inside my confessional. All three of them are kind of similar this way. Just like you're used to, inside the confessional, there's a spot where the priest is seated. And then, for the one going to confession, there's the opportunity to either kneel down or to go face to face. And so, Inside my confessional here, there's the option to kneel down behind the screen and just receive the sacrament anonymously. Or if you'd like, you can be seated here in the chair across from me and go face to face. Both of those options are available in all three of our confessionals. When you come into confession, make sure you close the door behind you so that everyone else knows that the confessional is in use. And when you finish your confession as you come out, leave the door open so that the next parishioner or penitent knows that the confessional is available. Each of the rooms has been soundproofed, so you'll see inside my confessional here. In addition to the interior walls that are insulated, we've set up some additional sound absorbing tiles and all of that just to ensure a, a nice quiet place as you celebrate the sacrament. So um, that's our tour. Three new confessionals here. Our confession schedule remains the same throughout the year. The only thing that's different is we're now in the parish activity center and we have three new confessionals for the year. And we look forward to meeting you here as we celebrate this amazing gift of God's mercy poured out in the sacrament of reconciliation. God bless you all.